I got my water, baby, it's so good and it's so cold And I'm not tuned in to the Sounds World Show Make sure that you subscribe, like, share, and you can comment too I wanna give a shout out to all the Sammy Boo Sam's World, 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 But guess what? We're not alone. Who could it be? Who could it be, Sammy Boos? I got my baby. I got my water baby. I got my baby. Hey, I got my water baby. I got my baby. She is so good at it. Cool. Look, if y'all want a cold water bottle, look in my description box down below. Put it in the code SW and get 10% off. 10 off your entire order. But anyway, today, guys, listen. First, though, to all my returning Sammy Boos, thank y'all so much for always coming back every day, every day, watching these videos I put out. I thank y'all so much. And if you are new to my channel, please go ahead and hit that subscribe button and the bell, yeah, the bell, so you'll be notified each and every time I upload a video. And then what? Boom! Straight to your phone, baby. Straight to your hello. But anyway, today, guys, welcome, y'all, welcome. But anyway, today, guys, we are eating us some loaded hot dogs, okay? With these new fried pickle and ranch chips. Y'all probably can't see them, it's a glare, probably. But they fried pickle and uh, ranch lays limited time edition, okay? So, um, I'm gonna go ahead, I wanna set my grace so I can go ahead and build them. If they build, if you build them, they will come. Uh-huh, glory. Heavenly Father, I want to thank you for this food I'm about to receive for the nourishment of my body. And Lord, please bless it. Let's fortune In Jesus' name I pray. And Lord, please continue to cover me and my family. And Lord, cover my Sammy Boos and their family. In Jesus' name I pray. Amen. 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 My eye is what? Running, run, run. You better run, run. Just don't run away. Mm. Just don't run away. Don't run away. I'll come back real quick. Anyway, I don't say it, my grace. We're finna build them. If you build them, they will come. Let me put this down right quick. Right quick. All right. Y'all, how y'all been doing, Sammy Boo? We got to let's talk about it. Hey, let's talk about it. Let's talk about it, y'all. Whoop, whoop. We got it. Put them little hot dogs right there. Y'all, honestly, shoot, if I had known, this is a hot dog from Sam's Club right there. <laughs> it went to Sam's Club yesterday. And I said, you know, I didn't eat my hot dogs. So, you know, I dropped them in the fryer. Anyway, I like fried hot dogs. I don't like boiled hot dogs. I'm hot. We just said our grace. We're going to make these up. This is my slaw for it. What I want on first? I gotta put a little bit of mayonnaise on the bottom right here. Sammy Boo! I love y'all. Y'all I'm feeling better every single day, y'all. Every single day. Every day I'm getting better. Every day I'm getting strong. I'm stronger. I'm wiser. I'm better. So much better. Y'all, I feel better. Y'all know I was going through it. I really was. I was going through it, Sammy Boos. Put some cheese on here. Hey. What have y'all been doing now? Mmm. Mmm, some good chiller. Mm. Yeah, this is going to be so good to me. So good. So good. I have you. This one, I'm just going to make a chili dog. Put a little bit of cheese right there. Put a little bit more chili. Mm. Yeah, I'm ready to bite. I'm sitting there right there, sorry. And let me move these on up. So I can put my fried pickle chips, fried pickle ranch. 
Oh, they look real, um, you know, I like a coated chip. You know what I'm saying? Like, you know, a lot of speckles and things on here. They look good. Smell good, too. I like me a lace chip anyway. Lace tastes like a uh, chicken when you've been drinking. <laughs> I ain't even tasting them, y'all. I just chew them hard. It's good. Mmm. I like them. Mm-hmm. Look at this. Whoa. Look at that dog out. Y'all see that? Y'all see that? Come through and get you a bite, honey. Why you biting? Hey, let me get my bite. Mmm. Mm. Mm. That's that Nathan's hot dog right there. My God. Come through Nathan. Why you coming? Hold on. Y'all, this Dr. Pepper is in the house. Whew. Let me tell y'all something. Y'all nephew Jordan been here for days. Weeks. About two or three. I've been trying to get him on a video. Yeah, he will not. He won't. Mm, that's gonna be good. That little cheese milk. I gotta hurt him get over there. Put me a little bit of spice and mustard across him. Mm. Y'all, do y'all like chili dogs? I love them. And heavy on the chili. And the cheese. Heavy on that. Oh. Mmm. Next time I come in and bought that hot dog. You know what I'm saying? A lot of times when you go buy hot dogs, that tastes different when you make hot dogs at home. They do for real. This is good. Mm. That's all I want is that boo. Hot dogs and chips. Come through. Yeah. Somebody done text me today. Call me. They call me. I had a red this time. They called back. And they must have answered. It was incoming. And it was only on for seven six seconds. I answered the call. Seven seconds. Seven seconds is a long time on phone. And then they gonna text me, who are you? Now I said, what are y'all saying the booth? I do apologize because I got ugly just as well as they got ugly. Who you? I said, who you? I mean, you call me, so who are you? They text me that. Let me tell you what they say. Who you? I said, who you? You call me, so who are you? They said back again, who you? And I said, stop playing on my phone. They text me, MF had a missed call from this number, F you. They call me dumb A M F for who you? I said simple sign. All 
all you had to do was call and say I had a missed call instead of this dumb A, who you text. They say, man, if you. And I sent them my avatar, bye bye. Why, well, that got to be a chap saying it, boo. Or somebody looking for their, looking in their husband's phone and seeing if that was me. But see, I don't talk to people's husbands and boyfriends no more. So it wasn't that. I don't know who it was. If it was somebody grown, all they had to do was say, hello, I had a missed call from you. Um, did you call me? No. It's like it's somebody searching, you know? And it was a whole different way area code than where I'm from. All they had to do was say hello. Instead of calling me, texting me who you like a child. Who you? Mm. Mm. Mm-mm. This one right here, oh god, that's real good too. This one is a ballpark um, bunless beef. Good. People don't need to be playing on people's phone these days. Shoot, I ain't asked for that. Minding my own business. And I'm sure if they had just called me, it would have been nothing. Because I ain't been, I ain't been talking to nobody, boyfriend. And I'm done crap like that for real. That sounds some old time crap when you're young. The girlfriend looking for the number, honey. They took the number out the boyfriend and not phone. And I'm trying to find out who you, who you talking to. Tell my phone with that nonsense. I want this one. Mm. Mm. Mm -mm -mm. That is fun. Yeah, we're gonna reach around and read in a minute. Let me get finish this hot dog. Mm. These are pretty good, but um, to be real, I think that the dill pickle, like the regular dill pickle, are stronger, like the stronger dill than these are. I guess because they got that ranch in there, mix, you know, bringing it down a little bit. So I'll be messing my hair. But they good, but they not as strong as a dill flavor as you know plain old dill. It's good. Mm. Mm. Mm -hmm. So good. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. <laughs> We're about to read. For my big old bite on that, so we can take a big bite on that. We're gonna take a big bite on that, honey. Let's get the story. 
Yeah, I'm ready to send boo. I'm ready. Hold on. <laughs> We're going to take a big bite on this. Mm. I guess. Yeah. We'll set that right there. Yeah, I'm ready to send my boo. Here you go. Did I say let's talk about it? Uh, let's talk about it. Y'all ready to go? And look, y'all, these have been coming from Sammy Boo's. So I appreciate y'all, Sammy Boo's. We ain't read no um, strawberry letter in I don't know how long. Um, now, I don't know where they're getting these from. Some of them, uh, you know, I just don't know. Um, but I have, man, listen. They have someone been juicing. Oh, someone been juicing. I appreciate that. Y'all keep sending them in. Sam, I am CBD on Instagram. Send them. Okay, I'm ready to read. Listen. I've been married to my husband for 18 years, and we have three children. Although all is not rosy, I do my best as a woman to bring comfort to this house. My husband went out to cheat on me, which ended in sickness. Uh-huh. It says in sickness and in health. Uh-huh. I don't know what happened, but he came home I guess in the middle of the night when two of his friends were holding him. He later confessed to me that he took some manpower, uh-huh, man power, uh-huh, some manpower to have intercourse with the lady and after the act, he could not stand on his feet. My goodness, my goodness. Read. So there's rust of his gear. Read. He has been bedridden for the past six months. I have been taking care of him, taking him to the hospital and the rest. Now our finances is running off because of medication. I have to sell my clothes and other things to support the welfare of our house. My mother has a big chop, I don't know what that is. My mother has a big chop bar, I don't know what a chop bar is, but my mother has a big chop bar outside where we live. And I want to go out and support her so I can take care of myself and my children. But leaving my husband at home is a problem. I get annoyed when I remember his cheating and want to leave. Sammy Boo, she just wants to know what should she do about that. Sammy Boo, we gonna what? Take a big old bite of mm, on that. Mmm. Mm. Hold up. Uh-uh. Yeah. Mmm. <laughs> That's a big one, that's a little. She been married to this man for 18 years. My God, what would I do? I would choke his, I want to choke his, his out. Lord have mercy. 18 years, three kids. He then went out with the boys, went out with the boys. He probably called the boys once his ass, once his hips, rusty hips. Couldn't move no more. And it went with this little young guy probably. 18 years, y'all up there in age. Y'all ain't no young folk. Not real young. Um, they took your little manpower pill, little blue pill probably. And then took the pill and can't stand up on your own no more. Sir, your rusty hips will be that sir. <laughs> I have to fend for himself. I know the Bible says sickness ain't in hell. But he didn't say if he go out there to be with another woman and come back sick. Is that still in sickness ain't in hell, y'all? Huh? Now I treat him like what that what that woman name on uh Charles. Um uh what the movie called? Charlie Perry movie. Charles Charles. Charles mm. 
That shirt, mm, that rusty hit, mm. She a good one. She a good one. That man that went and cheated on her and then come back and came out and been in the bed six months going back into the fork to the hospital and getting medication. He done messed his whole stuff up over that little blue pill and then what with me? What would y'all do, Sammy Booz? What would you do? Would you leave his little rusty hips where he at? Where your mama and your sisters at? They need to come and get you. <laughs> People probably look at you like, oh, you such a bad woman that you want to take care of him. He whole cheating on her. What's she supposed to do? And then her fault she's sick. Now she got to put her whole life on hold. Her and her kids struggling now because he can't work. She can't work because she can't leave him by himself. And baby, his ass up in a nursing home. I might not believe him, you know, I might do my part. But he done work some damn well. And we're gonna see what that insurance look like. Huh? He can't stay here. I gotta take care of me and my kid. Where that little gal at that you was laying with? Go get her. Tell her to come pick you up. She got some over here. She got some mail. Mm-hmm. That she needs to come and pick up. We can't deliver it. She gotta go and pick it up. He can go right on over there. But I think I will. After so long, he look like he ain't gonna get no better. Nurse at home or something. Or try. I don't know if it costs money to go to nurse home. I don't know. I don't know, right? Too, guys, we look at it on the woman's side like she should take care of her husband because the woman is a more nur nurturing, gonna take care of you type of woman. You know, that's what women do most of the time. We're gonna take care, we're gonna make sure everything all right. Women are the backbone of the household sometimes, y'all. That we hold it, we are the glue that hold it together. He can go out here and work, he can go out here and do, do the little, but the woman is that one who's gonna make sure this, them other little things is all taken care of, you know, all up in there, everything. From the children to the to the husband, all the way. A lot of times the husband do his part, you know, but the woman is that she go in between the cracks. You know what I'm saying? He making it, you know, just being real now. And that, some men out there do the same thing, but I'm saying if you want to look at the stereotypes of the scenario, the stereotypes, women are the more more nurturing nurturing. So, but what if it was on the other foot? What if he had, what if she had went it out and cheated, went it out? What if she went out and cheated and she come back sick and then he, she tell him that he, that she cheated on him, that's why she's sick? He gonna put her hips out. I promise you that. He'll, he'll move on. That man ain't gonna wait. Like a woman would. Mm-mm. I don't know if I could be that woman. Probably cool with my crazy self. We right there taking care of his little lady. Mad every day. think that like I said if the tables were turn he wouldn't take care of her especially if you think he couldn't make ends meet because he can't leave the house and everything because of her should have been kicked out but then we got our other side who gonna love him to death do you part they took their vows and that's what they mean and I honestly feel like that's more of the older generation to be real. For real, for real. Older women gonna tough it out, baby. They believe in their vows. Today, these women gonna get a divorce right quick. Come here right quick. Let me sign that paper, honey. Bye. 
You know what I'm saying? But the older women, they tend to, you know, stick around through more. Um, we was talking on this on the topic of um, on the on one of the other let's talk about. We was talking about how older women stick it out. She was like, uh, he been cheating on her, and she don't understand why she don't care and why she can't laugh and stuff. And I just feel like the older women, they just feel like, shoot, he ain't bother me. And and the same thing. And the thing she said was she just prayed about it and got right with God about it, and she just keep on going. Now, I don't know what kind of relationship they have with her knowing that, they, that he cheating, but some women take it to God, let it go, and keep and stay right there in that marriage. I don't know. But y'all put down in comments what y'all think. Okay, I done got full. I don't know the whole thing. I'm full. Shit, I'm full. God, I won't eat that. Let me take one bite. Mm-mm. Mm -hmm. But anyway, guys, like I said, put that in the comments what y'all think about this. Let's talk about it. And I'm gonna go ahead and all and go. We're gonna fool. Listen, thank y'all so much for stopping by. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and what? Comment down below. And until next time, bye bye. Mwah. We're just gonna eat a little bit of ice right now. Mm, if we can, okay?
Надо класса. Ready, see it, go. I got my baby, I got my baby, I got my baby, I got my water baby, I got my baby, I got my water baby, I got my baby, I got my water baby, it's so good and so cold, so cold, so good and so cold, so cold, so good and so cold, so cold, so good and so cold, I got my water baby, it's so good and it's so cold, so cold, so good and so cold, I wanna welcome y'all to the Sand World Show, make sure that you subscribe, like, share, y'all can go comment too, I wanna welcome y'all to the Sand World Show, make sure that you subscribe, like, share, y'all can comment too, I wanna welcome y'all to the Sand World Show, make sure that you subscribe, like, share, y'all can comment too, I wanna give a shout out to all the Sand Me Boo, subscribe, like, share, Share and you can come in too. I wanna give a shout out to all the same people. Hey, I got my baby. I got my water baby. I got my baby. I got my water baby. I got my baby.